everyone and welcome back to the channel. I hope you're all doing really well. If you're new here, then hi, welcome. My name is Kaylee and I create fashion, a bit of beauty and lifestyle content here on YouTube and over on TikTok and Instagram. I'll always make sure to leave my other socials down in the description. So if you want to go and have a nose, then feel free. But as you can tell by the title, today's video is a haul. I just love sitting down and filming hauls. Um, so yeah, as you can tell by the title, it's going to be a naked fashion one. Um, I think I've done a brief naked fashion, um, haul on my channel before. I think I did one last year around summertime. So I have really be kindly gifted all of these items. However, they've not actually asked me to do this video. Um, I kind of just wanted to do this off my own back, um, to put on my channel. It's something to put out there, a bit of content for you guys. Um, and some of these pieces are honestly so sick and I just can't wait for you to see so let's just get straight into it. So the first thing I have here is this really cute pink, kind of like a dusty pink which I really love, um, ribbed top and it's got this kind of um, lettuce hem which I always think adds just like a little bit extra to the top and it just makes it look really cute and I thought this would be a really nice um staple piece for my wardrobe as we're going to be transitioning into spring soon so yeah i just thought it was a really cute little top the material is so great like it's such a nice quality one thing i found with naked stuff is that all their products are really good quality whether it doesn't fit you so well or not the quality is always there which is absolutely amazing yeah i've got this in a small it fits really nicely it's just going to be nice to wear underneath some things like i've got this nice little um denim pinafore dress um that i do like to whip out sometimes and i think that would look really cute underneath that with some converse or something just as like a everyday outfit so yeah absolutely love this little piece like i said it's an absolute staple for your wardrobe so the next thing i have are these jeans now i'm not gonna lie um they don't fit me the way i wanted them to well it did say straight leg on the website um I think mum jeans are more my vibe than anything else. Like, I'm not very good with baggy jeans or anything anyway. Um, so I do think I was probably stepping out of my comfort zone with this. Um, but yeah, really nice pair of jeans. They don't fit me overly well, but I think that is just because I personally do struggle finding a good pair of jeans that fit me. But one thing I really liked about these jeans is that they actually have like a badge on the back. If you remember me saying in a misguided haul, um, cause I've got some misguided black ripped mum jeans and they've got a label on the back. Like I just love like a good label on a pair of jeans. It just makes jeans look so much more expensive than they actually are. Um, and that's kind of the whole reason why I bought these jeans. Um, but I got these in a, oh, no wonder they're big. They're a size 12. I could have sworn I picked up a tan. A 38. I thought 38 was a 10. Oh, uh, it's a bit confusing because on their website, they're not exactly UK sizes. They... So on some items they'll do like small, medium, large and then on some things they'll do like EU sizes. So it's like 36, 38, 40, blah, blah, blah. Um, so yeah, not gonna lie, I thought these were first size 10 and they're not and they're a size 12. So no wonder they don't fit me. Um, oh, well that's just gone right out the window then. Um, but anyway, they're really nice. They're, like I said, really good quality. They've got pockets on the back and then they just like this, look like this at the front. They're just a staple pair of jeans um, because I don't have any light wash mum jeans. So that's kind of what I was going for. Um, oh, I'm gutted that that's why. If they were a size 10, then I would have had, I would have been okay about it. But the fact that they're a size 12 and I didn't even notice bit gutting um but yeah really good quality i just love and like the pockets are nice and deep like they're not too small like they're just a really good pair of jeans so this is probably one of my favorite items that i got from them and i picked up this really gorgeous um it's kind of more of a khaki it does look more stone um kind of camel color um no more stone on the screen on the camera screen than here because it is more of like a camely kind of khaki color which i would have preferred it to look like what it looks like on the camera um 
but yeah it doesn't matter too much um but it's really cute it's super thick it's just a lovely it's kind of cropped as well actually um puffer jacket and it's kind of like it's kind of like a suede material but it's not suede it's actually raining isn't it i think it's actually raining oh that's gutting um and then it has like a high neck as well like so you can proper like wrap it around your neck because i i just love feeling like really cozy and like just comfortable and like i can just imagine me chucking this on um with a pair of leggings and just some like my white nike hairs or something and just like red getting ready and going sort of thing just a everyday sort of jacket um and yeah i've just been wanting a jacket in this sort of color for a while now so when i saw this i thought i'm gonna have to go and pick that up um i did get this in a 38 so i'm guessing this means it's a 12 as well it was a bit confusing because i had to look up the sizes on yeah it doesn't tell me whether that's a 12 or not but going by that i'm assuming it's a 12 um it does fit me fine though it's not too big like i'll just put it on now so you can see yeah it's not entirely like massive actually now putting on putting it over a sweater anyway because i paired it with this like i made the whole out of it this this top and the jeans um but it is nice it just it does fit nicely i mean i'm hoping i can keep it and i'll make some wear out of it but um yeah really nice really nice quality as well and it's actually like super thick um the only thing is is that with things like this like a cropped like when it's cropped i would have preferred it to have a drawstring or something with it but um it doesn't have that unfortunately but i can't pick and choose um but yeah really nice quality again just a really nice piece and i'm looking forward to wearing that so i actually picked up a pair of trainers i'm not gonna lie i won't be able to keep these because they're actually quite narrow and i do think i actually have quite wide feet um but i'm gonna show you them anyway um they are these kind of like stone kind of um nude trainers and they're kind of like reflective i don't know if you can see it on here but i think this bit that goes down is reflective and then they've got it here as well on this side they are suede like this part here is suede um and then it's like netted here they're just some really nice chunky trainers and i did say to myself that i wanted um a new pair of like new trainers because i don't have any um well i do have some but they're not great they're not in the great best condition um but yeah i got these i did get them in my normal size i did get these in a seven which is what i am yes don't charge big feet for girl um but yeah <laughs> They are just a little too narrow for me, so I am going to have to do something about that. Um, yeah, I won't be able to keep them, unfortunately. So if you want them, if you're watching this and you want them, hit me up. Um, otherwise, they're really nice and I just love the chunkiness of them. Like, I love a good pair of chunky trainers. Um, so yeah, I mean, it's a, bit, it's a bit annoying that they don't fit. But um, it was nice to see them in person and, like, actually know now that I do kind of like that sort of style um so yeah absolutely loved that now i picked up two other pieces that i also made into an outfit and oh my god it's so basic but it just looks so lush i actually wore this outfit out last friday um for a night out with my friend and honestly oh just the quality the quality is just amazing so i picked up this little black crop top and it just looks pretty plain at the front but when you turn it backwards on the back it has a really cool lace up which i just thought was so nice and honestly the material of this it's cotton and it's so thick which i just thought was perfect for this time of year when it is just a bit more chilly um just absolutely love like it's just so basic but you can it's not so basic but it's a basic piece and you can just make it look nice like do you know what i mean um absolutely love it's just so soft so comfy um and i'm not gonna lie if i can wear something comfy on a night out then i am winning at life <laughs> um so yeah again i think i got this in a size small i'm pretty sure i would have done if i can find the tag uh yes i got this in a small um so that is kind of like that is my go that is my size um and i 
didn't change it because I didn't think I needed to, which I didn't, which was great. And then to pair with that, I got these really, really sick flares. Well, they're kind of, I don't think they were called flares on the website. I think they were just called like trousers, but they're basically flares. Um, again, really, really thick material and it's got a really nice sturdy elas um, elasticated um, waistband. Like, you know, sometimes when you pick up things that have a waistband in it and you can just tell that it's going to move and like, I have a pair of pyjamas that have a waistband in it and it just moves and it turns and it's all weird. But this is like really sturdy. They've properly like made it, you know. Um, so yeah, it's these flares and it's actually got a slight bit of like um, seam going down it, like seam detailing um, on either side of the leg. Just ignore that, that's a piece of fluff. I tried to cut it off earlier but it didn't come off obviously. Um, so yeah, it looks like this and again, I, got, I actually got these in a size small which I'm really glad I did because I usually get a medium for things um, on, my, on the bottom because I'm an 8 on the top but I'm a 10 on the bottom usually. Um, but to know that I fit into a pair of size small trousers is absolutely amazing. Um, but yeah, I'm really glad I did because you want these to kind of feel fitted and these definitely were. But what I also really liked about them is that at the bottom they've got a, um, not a rip. What's this called? What's this called? Like it's got a split, it's got a split hem. Split hem, that's what it is. Um, and yeah, I just really thought that added a little bit of extra and it's kind of nice that it's got that because when you've got a pair of heels on, it kind of just gives that extra bit of space around your foot. Like that probably sounds really weird, but in my head that makes sense. So hopefully it makes sense to you. Um, but honestly, the nicest pair of flares I've ever put on, um, like I mentioned earlier, really thick quality so you literally can't see anything through them. Um, you can literally wear whatever you want, whatever colour pants you want under it, to be fair. Um, but yeah, just a really great pair of trousers. And I can tell I'm going to be wearing these to death. So that is the end of the video, guys. I hope you really liked the pieces that I picked up. Like always, I will drop links for everything down below. Um, I've also got a code that I did not mention earlier, um, which is Kaylee M x20 i think whatever it is i'll pop on the screen now i'll write it down in the description just in case you forget um but yeah that gives you 20 percent off full priced items i think um i did check it out the other day which i've been pretty sure that is what it does um but yeah a really good steal there if you want to buy anything um i'm hoping you like the pieces that i picked up today so maybe you might pick up something that I got from this haul um but yeah I hope you really enjoyed this video guys and I will see you very soon bye